found something that I have to do that has to be on street corners. Last Tuesday, me and Oakley were sitting out on the porch resting after dinner, which I don't get a chance to do much of, when lo and behold, all up and down the bottom, lights come on, twinkling like stars. Oakley said, praise be to God. He's gotten real religious. I said, I think you ought to say praise be to the Appalachian Power Company. <laughs> he said, you're a sassy woman, but you're mine. And it ain't no way to make a living from a farm. And for somebody that loves farming as much as Oakley does, not to do any good at it is awful. It's not you, I keep telling him, it's the depression. But Oakley is always working. His face turned away. Except he does do right much politicking around. He's a real good Democrat. One time he voted for a dead man because he was a Democrat. <laughs> and now sitting here, watching these lights twinkling like fairy lamps through this blue haze. I can sense a big change coming, but it ain't got up here yet. Your sister, Ivy. Now then, about the divorce. There's not a reason in the world to feel bad about that. The divorce, like the TV, is the wave of the future, if you ask me. <laughs> And it was not your fault. It was in his nature, and that is that. So maybe it's not as unnatural as we all think. And thank you for sending your book. It, it was pretty good. Although I do think you could have used more of a love interest. And you might want to put in more plot next time, too. <laughs> you have got a nerve going into politics over there. I did not raise you to be a fat cat or a Republican. 